let's see if anyone's gonna place one of these gears up onto the airship in the autonomous period. I see one on the Red Alliance okay, so making its way up onto the airship. Oh, it falls back into the robot. Not quite enough time, but over on the blue line side, a successful gear delivery. I believe that was by presentation invasion on a blue alliance, getting that gear delivered, earning the blue alliance 75 points all during auto. The blue red alliance now is at 55. I've said it before, we've got that 20 point difference. Thanks to the autonomous score, it can make or break a match for these alliances getting those extra 20 autonomous points. If all three robots deliver those autonomous gears, they can actually earn 40 autonomous points, but we've yet to see that today. 1351 on the Blue Alliance TKO. They're lining up along with their alliance partners. Presentation, or Blazing Bulldogs both grabbing gears from that line station at the same time. And the Blazing Bulldogs just dropped off another one at the Blue Alliance airship. They need three more to get their next rotor moving. Red Alliance needs all four for rotor number three. These rotors, as I've said, take a more increasing number of gears each to repair. We need one ro one gear for the first rotor, two gears for the second rotor, four gears for the third rotor, and six for rotor number four. It's a time consuming process, but delivering these gears is the only way to get these ships airborne as the Blue Alliance gets one more gear towards their rotor number four. They just need two more. All three blue robots now headed over into the retrieval zone, trying to grab one more gear. They need two more in total to finish off the airship. Meanwhile, on the Red Alliance, Peninsula Robotics heads out on its own to the Red Alliance retrieval zone to grab another gear. Deep Blue has a gear in their machines, trying to get it lined up on the davit, or on the gear spring, rather, for the Red Alliance airship. The Blue Alliance now looks like Peninsula Robotics, or sorry, Presentation Invasion and their alliance partners also TKO have gears in their machine. They have all all two of them they need to get their next rotor moving, but now we're up the final 30 seconds already. The Blazing Bulldogs are the first ones up in the air trying to trigger that touch pad. Blue Alliance gets their next rotor spinning for an extra 40 points, 50 points for climbing robots, and all three blue robots are ready for takeoff. They're at 305. Red Alliance robots now trying to climb aboard. Two seconds left. Can they make it on the airship as time expires? 6036 Peninsula Robotics, so close to climbing aboard and triggering that light pad, but there isn't quite enough time. We do have those official scores scored live up onto the screen. It's now the Blue Alliance completing that race first with a score of 305. Red Alliance.